Only a boat these days means you need somewhere to moor it, store it, and of course, there's that tricky bit of actually launching the boat. Wouldn't it be great if the boat could magically make its way from the land into the water? Well, some clever little cookie has come up with a solution. But who could come up with something so crazy? Yeah, Glenn, these uh, sea legs amphibious boats are designed and manufactured in New Zealand. Clever Kiwis come up with the idea of a boat with wheels. They're really appealing to people who are lucky enough to have waterfront properties. They can keep their boat in the garden, crank it up, roll out of the garden, down the beach and into the water. None of this, you know, hitching the, uh, the trailer up to the four-wheel drive and driving three k's to the boat ramp and uh, swearing at the missus. Um, <laughs> it's going to save a lot of marriages. But uh, it has a sort of 10 kilometer an hour capability on land and about a 40 knot capability on uh, water. They're about to take Australia by storm. Well, it looks pretty good, so let's take it for a spin. And just like that, we hit the water and jetted for the head to see how this baby handled the water. Here we are at the very tip of the Mornington Peninsula, right in front of the Point de Pere National Park. Just inside the heads with the famous Corsair surf break just over there. Will, I didn't bring the board, but next time I'm out there, I might be calling on you and sea legs. Not a problem, Glenn. <laughs> Well, I have to admit, I was a little bit sceptical, but these sea legs are a serious piece of machinery. Let's go for a cruise. Let's go and check out some of the locals, shall we? Let's go. Our next stop is Chinaman's Hat, a former defence structure which has been renovated and is now home to some very cheeky and extremely smelly Australian fur seals. Woo-wee! Mate, I put on plenty of aftershave and deodorant this morning. I know it's not you, but these guys absolutely reek. It's enough to put you off your lunch. Well, not me, mate. After all this hard work, I think I owe you a beer. What do you reckon? Let's go. Woo! See you later. And with that said, we headed for the pub and got the Rockstar Park right out the front. Or maybe that's out the back. Will, I'm very impressed with the door-to-door -door service, but do you think you could get sea legs to go up the stairs? We could give it a shot, but I felt as though you needed the exercise. Oh, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> If you're interested in the amphibious phenomena, call 1300 Sea Legs or check out their website.